situation is that many people don't realize that white men took covenants and their forefathers took covenants to come to the African continent after a decree made by a pope in 1453 that they must go and discover the black world anywhere where there are non-Christians, anywhere where there are brown, and brown peoples and non-white peoples, they must conquer, they must uh, begin to develop European principles and European development patterns on those lands and to enslave the people into perpetuity. And that meant they would have to take property rights. Wait, are you saying this is a, as a real thing? It is a real thing. The Pope yes, there sent is. people to go and conquer. 100%. Jeez, what, what please was, continue. What Sorry. was happening is that in Europe, um, Europeans had gone into the Renaissance or the uh, Enlightenment. The Enlightenment brought up a lot of science, a lot of development. But that lots of development began to mean that they were consuming resources at a half faster pace sure. than they could replenish them. They were also beginning to destroy the environment, pollute water bodies, pollute the land, pollute the air. And that began to cause hunger in Europe. And that hunger caused a lot of wars in Europe. And that's why you see there's a lot of wars in European history. Sure. And I always hear people say, Black people love fighting. No, no, no. No other animal on earth fights each other <laughs> than the European, which is what you're seeing with Ukrainian war sure. right now. It's what they used to. That's what they used to. And <laughs> when they began to kill each, other, kill each other, there was this forward thinking that was coming from the church, which they were trying to escape from, by the way, when they went into the Enlightenment. Yeah. And the Pope then decided that, listen here, we are not going to sustain um, this race if we keep fighting each other. We're actually going to eliminate ourselves. And this is something a guy called Lothrop started wrote a lot about. That Sorry, Europeans, who? a guy called Lothrop started. Lothrop? Lothrop started. Started. What he is, is he's one of the biggest uh, preachers of white supremacy. Mm. And he says that there was a point where Europeans actually were 33% of the global population. Sure. But they reduced from that amount to about 17% because of fighting each other and killing Jeez. each other in the Great Wars. Mm -hmm. So what the Pope said in 1453 already, 1453, 1454, guys, we're not going to make it. We are going to die. We're going to become extinct by fighting each other, by diseases, by sicknesses, by pollution, mm -hmm. and by the depletion of resources. So we need to spread out. And you need to go anywhere where they are non-white. You need to go anywhere where they are non-Christians and then you need to settle there so that we can spread our nation out. Hence, they began to move from the European continent. The migration that we call, we're arguing about in Africa right now was caused by this great migration from Europe where they had to go and find new lands and they had to settle those new lands. And what I always say to South Africans is this,